The ashes are still smoldering after an early Saturday morning fire destroyed St. Mary's Church in Red Lake. Our Josh Peterson shares with us the memories and how the church will move forward after the fire. What was once a historic landmark in Red Lake in a matter of moments was reduced to a pile of rubble after an early morning fire Saturday. St. Mary's Mission Church was still smoldering Sunday, just over 24 hours after the fire was put out. For members of the congregation, the sight of the church reduced to ashes was heartbreaking. The um, comments yesterday were about personal sadness, sorrow, even devastation about hearing that the church had burned down. Over the weekend, many community members came to view the site of was once the center of Red Lake. Many stood in disbelief at what had happened. For many, it was a chance to reflect and remember. We've had baptisms and confirmations, and um, my husband and I were married here. Mm -hmm. So it's, I'm 70 years old, and my entire life has been entwined with the church. As the ashes still smolder, church went on as usual at the school next door, bringing not only a congregation, but a community together. Father Jerry Rogers describes the fire as if it was the death of an elder, saying that members in the community need time to grieve and reflect. That church has been a source of wisdom for over a century. And not only that, it's where wisdom resided. Because for us as Catholics, wisdom is Jesus. Father Rogers, along with members of his congregation, feel that this is a time that will bring people together and strengthen the spiritual community. The church has not burnt. The church is very much alive. It's in the hearts of our people, and I'm, I, I, I am assured that um, um, the future will have a hopeful um, future. I think it will be a renewal and, a, and a reinvigorating of the church, it's of the people who are the church. Father Rogers asked for everyone to pray for all the members of his church. At a time when all seems lost, the love and saving grace of God is found working within each member of the congregation and rising up to meet any challenge head on. In Red Lake, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. No foul play is suspected. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.